Well, damn, there's some timing, eh? Just released a huge in-depth video on all the recent news, and then the biggest news breaks, guys. It is official. Mark Bergevin's tenure with the Montreal Canadiens is over, and so is Trevor Timmons' tenure as, as head of the scouting department and also assistant GM. I mean, he's been with the franchise for many, many years here, you know, responsible for drafting all the way back to Carey Price in 2005. So uh, it's it's an end of an era here. You know, I already mentioned it. You can check out my full thoughts on the, on the Jeff Gordon stuff, which I'm really excited for. This is a, a really, really good hire. But Bergevin and Timmons, you know, not perfect. We all know this. But they've set up Jeff Gordon to enter in in a very favorable position here. Tons of assets throughout the franchise. And I, I have a lot a lot to say about the, the era of Mark Bergevin and... And, and we'll go through that at some point, breaking it down in depth. But right now, Jeff Gordon has a ton of assets in all areas moving forward. He gets to hire his own GM, his own scouting staff, which is very exciting. I mean, he has a really strong track record as an executive in the NHL. Of course, going back to the Bruins days, all of what he did for them, drafting Marchand and Lucic. As well as Kessel, he brings in Rask via trade to that franchise. He signs Chara and Savard. I mean, very strong moves that set them up for success long term. Goes to the Rangers, you know, has a has great track record with, with scouting and development of young players. But again, he brings in Zabanajad via trade with from Ottawa. Huge. He brings in Adam Fox from Carolina, who ends up winning the Norris and looks to be one of the best defensemen in the NHL for many years to come as a puck mover. Strong defensively, but offensively dynamic. You love to see him bring that philosophy into Montreal and then of course you just have the, the rebuild that they recently completed that's a lot of Jeff Gordon's work so he fits in as, as a president or he comes in as executive vice president of hockey operations under Jeff Molson who's going to remain as president which I don't know about that can you bud can you just let the hockey guys do the hockey stuff uh, nonetheless, though, it's exciting to bring in Jeff Gordon. And like I mentioned, he gets to hire his own GM. It's likely going to be someone French. We're looking at Madden Jr., Darsh, Patrick Waugh, you know, who hasn't been called yet. But I don't think that matters because Gordon's going to be starting that process. He literally just gets hired as executive vice president here. So it's going to be interesting to see who it is. Love to hear what you guys think. If you want my full thoughts, check out that uh, the other video I just uploaded. But yeah, this is this is crazy. End of an era. End of an era. It's good to have... Something to look forward to. And I don't think this team needs a huge rebuild. Honestly, there's so many strong pieces throughout this organization. Maybe, you know, a year or two, we can be turned around. We see a bunch of the prospects join the team. We've got a likely a lotto pick coming up here that could have an impact pretty quick for the roster. So, yeah, it's exciting. And, and uh, I think being Jeff Gordon to sit in that seat, I mean, lots of pressure here. Most historic franchise in the league, but I mean, he's got a lot of, to work with. He's one of the most well-respected executives around the league, and uh, it's good to, to add someone like uh, his caliber. So this is this is exciting. I'm I'm sad to see Bergevin go. I'm going to appreciate the memories of the Eastern Conference Final, the Cup Final. I mean, we have been one of the best Canadian teams, if not the best, in the league for the last ten to fifteen years, despite the ups and downs. So, yeah, first moves though for Gordon. Maybe talk to Carey Price, figure out what his you know plans are if he wants to stick around for what's going to happen you know talk to some of the other vets see how that goes but lots to be done definitely got to get a gm in the picture here and uh and a good one at that one with a, a you know a modern look on this on this game especially defense and puck movers anyway guys this is i can't believe it i'm just i'm honestly at a loss for words but i'm sure we'll be talking soon check out the most recent video i put up today and uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comments this is wild if you like this content hit the like and subscribe button go Habs, go baby